Now, TNT's football has endured a period of hardship that predates the pandemic and continues to this day. Senior women's head coach Kenwin Jones says equity and equality must form part of our attempts to rise up out of the gloom and into a brighter future. While this country's senior women's national program has made the news for its staffing issues recently, Ball State junior midfielder Chelsea Ralph reflected the great sense of belief around the team after this weekend's Panama friendlies. Just coming into the team from school, from college football, and joining with the lights of Meili, Yaya, Ria, Baby, Karen. This is it's just ecstatic. Like just seeing these play and players and working with these players, like you learn so much from them. And just having that experience of these players within the younger, the junior ones, as with my, as myself, we can go places. In the world of football management, there are coaches who are tactically sound. Those that seamlessly adapt to the conditions as they present themselves, others still are revered for their ability to get buy-in, not just in football matters, but on a granular human level. Kenwin Jones, who revealed his UEFA A license in early September, is one diploma away from being able to coach at the very highest levels of the game. Paper qualifications in hand, he certainly appears to have the other stuff too. Jones has, in the past, used this platform to advance a number of causes. Asked what women's football needed to succeed in Trinidad and Tobago, he minced no words. All I think that the women need is respect. Um, respect for, for their craft, respect for, for what they do. They have it for themselves, but I think um, all wider society needs to do that. And, and for far too long, I think the, 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 the women of Trinidad and Tobago um, have been disrespected have been operating with a lack of resources. And to be honest with you, I, I, um, I think it's a little bit more than the men because the men team as well, they, they, they suffer. But the women, I think they, they suffered a bit too much. And it's about time that things change around and we give them that respect that they, that they deserve. The newly minted head coach says if we don't, then we'll be collectively responsible for stifling the dreams of future generations of young women. A day after completing his second match in charge, Jones expressed his fealty to the group, doled out praise for other indispensable contributions to the team's success, and announced the formation of a support community aimed at propelling the women's program. Jovan Ravello, TTT Sport.